What's going on YouTube? This is Rick with a three package mail day. These are packages from Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday of this week. I believe today is April 16th. We're going to call it two and a half successful TTM returns as you'll see in just one second. Uh, I haven't been sending out much. I don't plan on sending out much. Um, I kind of go through these lulls where I send out a ton of mail and uh, then I kind of lay back and uh, whether I work on you know, PC projects or, you know, just kind of get bored with writing letters. So I, I can feel myself getting to that point. So, uh, I mean, that's, uh, that's the, that's that for right now. Um, in a previous video, I showed a home run hitters bat that had a bunch of signatures on it. Uh, I do plan to send that out. I believe TriStar is having a signing and I'm going to get, uh, Orlando Cepeda on that bat. And, uh, so, oh, my Tony Gwynn on the 3000 hit club bat, 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 the, uh, signing was supposed to be on the fourth. I was waiting for the, uh, bat to come back in the mail, never showed, come to find out the signing got moved back to the 19th. So I'm still waiting on that. We'll get into the TTMs now, I guess this is the, it is a success, but it kind of busted a project. Um, five uncanceled stamps, a, I don't know of one in 48 days. Let me give you a little backstory. I'll tell you who it's, I want to kind of spoil the surprise, but I sent to Larry Boa right before spring training, hoping to get him before he left. Long story short, I didn't, I didn't get him and I, I just got it back. Uh, this came back Monday. So the project was an eight by 10. It was black and white. And my vision was to get it signed in gold. It was going to look good. I was going to hang it up, yada, yada, yada. So uh, I I went through the trouble of buying a bunch of these gold Sharpies. Um, I had two successes on it prior. And, you know, I guess that kind of, you know, in what direction this is going now. I get the package back Monday. The marker's not included. And I open it up. And Mr. Boa did sign it, but he signed it in blue. So he kind of, you know, it's a success. And I'm very thankful that he took the time to sign it. But, you know, in retrospect, I would rather him just, you know, perfect scenario. He signs it in gold and I can continue, continue on the project. Um, you know, but the, the whole thing's kind of busted now because I wanted it all to be in gold. Call me crazy. Call me selfish. I'm like I said, very thankful that he took the time to sign it. It just sucks that this project is now kind of chewed up. So get into two cards that came in. These both came in today. First one from Baltimore, Maryland, a one of one in I don't know how long. I believe I sent this during the season last year. It's Tommy Hunter, signed in blue Sharpie. And the second one... Coming in from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, a one of one in 36 days. I think it's number 29 for the 93 Fleer set. Current GM, Ruben Amaro Jr. Shout out, Eddie. So that's it for my mail day over the last three days. Uh, about that, don't misinterpret what I'm saying. I'm very thankful that Larry Boa signed that. I'm just kind of bummed that it wasn't in gold. So. You know, don't think I'm some kind of joker. That's it. Look forward to hearing back and uh, take care.